Hello lovelies, I hope you're all having a fantastic day. I have just got out the shower, as you can see my hair is wet. It's been dripping on my top, so my top is wet, so you can probably see. But I am in Kerala, so I'm sure it'll dry. Within seconds now, the sun's come out, so that is nice. Got a bit of sunshine during this monsoon time. So I'm going to go to the Indian Asda today, so I may take you guys along with me to the Indian Asda. Uh, we are still on lockdown here. If you've been watching my previous vlogs, you will know that I am in India, in Kerala. We are on lockdown number two. So the first lockdown was nine weeks. It synced with the UK, just completely, completely was in synchrony because we went on lockdown on the 24th of March. The lockdown was for nine weeks and they were the exact same dates as in the UK lockdown. And now we are doing local lockdowns, again, just like the UK. I think Leicester, I'm not sure if that's on lockdown, but there were talks that they were going to put Leicester on lockdown. But they have put Varclay Resort on lockdown. So there's not much I can do, but I still have a very busy and exciting life. So stay tuned to find out why. So, the coastal resort in Vark was on lockdown, but the um, town certainly isn't on lockdown. As you can see, it's got motorbikes, tuk-tuks, shops. I mean, it's certainly quieter than usual. But it's not on lockdown. I say quieter than usual because since the nine week lockdown, we still haven't fully got going. We're just starting to reopen up, similar to the UK. And I did go to the Indian Asda, but the filming was a bit strange in there. The lighting was quite strange for the filming. So I'm coming to this fruit shop instead in Varkla Town. Look, it's got all my yogic food, my oranges, bananas, red bananas which are the most nutritional bananas under the sun. Pineapples, as you can see, that guy's just lifted up the pineapple. Lovely. Mangoes, yum. And look, that's apple custard. That's extremely nutrient dense. Some grapes, avocados. The shops, as you can see, it's in the middle of Varkla town. Wow, yogic food heaven. So I'm now taking a shopping break at Bacon Flake after the veg shopping. Vegetables, they wrap them in newspaper with an elastic band. I will show you what's in this little parcel later. But first I'm going to sit and enjoy my Indian chai. It really is um, a polar opposite world really between Varkla Resort and Varkla Town because to me it seems really, really busy, the town, but the resort is super quiet. The resort's like a little ghost town at the moment. So as you can see, there's some sort of major contrast going on here. Do I love it? Yes because it's just a very, very exciting life. Okay, my lovelies, I think I'm just going to sit and enjoy my chai. Mmm, something so nice about Indian chai. And I'll see you guys later. And show you my yogi fruit and veg later. So, what did I buy from that lovely fruit and veg shop? So, here's the parcel. We'll see inside this parcel. Ooh. I have got <gasps> pomegranates. Yum. Absolutely gorgeous and cup 
capsicle. That is the Malayalam word for pepper. I don't know the Malayalam word for pomegranates, but perhaps I should learn it since I'm here in Kerala. That would be an idea. And three potatoes. So I think I'll have a very interesting tea tonight. So, from the Indian Asda, I got... <gasps> Divine and delicious mangoes. Whoa! A mango juggle. And I also got peanut butter. And that peanut butter is uh, amazing because it's got zero cholesterol, zero trans fat, high in fibre and protein. You can't see that there. There we go. So, natural peanut butter. So, it is, uh, some of it is fruitarian, some of it not. So, predominantly fruit, veg and nuts is my diet out here. So, really healthy. I really do try and follow a yoga lifestyle, as you guys know. So, I think I'll be having a delicious tea tonight. But before that... I would like to do some yoga. Hello there. <laughs> Hello. So, the big question is, is it possible to surrender, absolutely surrender to what's going on in the world and take the yogic approach and the yoga lifestyle with good food and good exercise and general well-being and calmness and happiness. Well, the answer to that one from me would probably be yes. Why not? So if you do want any advice on how to keep calm, Look after yourself in the yogic approach. Just put your comments below. So, Um Namo Narayan Naya, Hari Om Tat Sat, Shanti Shanti Shanti, Om Namo Shivaya, Loka Samasta Sakano Nabandu. I'll thank you for watching my vlog today. Mwah. Bye, lovely. See you soon on the next vlog.